Right then, this is Flotilla, um, a indie PC game that was released on Steam yesterday, in fact. Uh, this is also coming out to Xbox Live indie scene as well, but right now I, I've just got it on the uh, PC. Anyway, um, Flotilla is a game where you just randomly explore the galaxy because you've only got 70 days left to live because of a terminal illness. And you click on planets to explore them and you get shit coming up like this. While exploring ancient ruins you encounter cats on the run some new authorities. Hello friend, I and me brethren need your help. Um, Rastafarian cats, yeah I'll help them. The intense chase ensues and you unit cats escape the authorities. Choo choo meow is a sigh of relief. Much love, much respect, we share our loot. Ooh. They gave me a quicker engine, nice. That's another good thing about this game, it's got um, like that little loot aspect behind it. At the end of the 70 days you are scored and there is a global scoreboard. Um, this game is mainly about the fighting though, and we'll get around to that in a minute. You and the crew sing karaoke. <laughs> 16 cases of vodka later, you find yourself declared the karaoke champion of the universe. You take your dessert to prize. What? <laughs> okay. That's it over. Ooh. That one looks like it's gonna be a fight. Get to this one first. God damn. Dear thing. Hate you. Your blind jump lands you in the middle of a slaver ring. The slavers lose their shipment of panda bears. You just lost a, a sleeve of pandas. Today ain't your day, bub. Oh dear. These guys aren't happy. Fortunately for me, though, they're driving the slowest fucking shittiest vehicles ever, so. I think I can get away. You have the upper hand as well because, uh, basically, um, these ships are weak from the rear or from the bottom, so the lower you are, and the behind them you are, I guess, if that's even a word, um, the more beneficial your position is. Um, it's real-time turn-based combat. Everyone moves around at the same time. Um, it's quite weird, but I love this classical music. There's some pieces here that you might recognise some gaming campaigns. Um, Halo 3 used one of the pieces of music in this game for one of their ads. Uh, so yeah. But enough about that. More to the fighting. As it happens, um, the actual combat on this is very simplistic but very tactical at the same time. It's really about outmaneuvering your enemy really. Also helps if you have good loot. I really dig the graphical style on this actually. It's very sort of retro basic. Um, very clean, very crisp. Looks very nice actually, I have to say. As you see, it's just harmlessly bouncing off the side of a ship at me. I need to get right underneath them, or... I think we're about to get some bottom hits. Yep, there you go. Love that ding sound. Now I'm going to be using something called Focus Fire Mode, which uh, 
basically means my guy can't move very far, but he'll literally concentrate all his efforts on basically spamming the enemy with missiles, which is kind of what I want at the moment. Because I at least want one of these things dead this turn, although that ship is actually getting dangerously close. Oh, please turn end soon. Shit! Oh, that hit. Yeah, that ship's gone. Oh, this isn't going very well. <laughs> Actually, I wonder if I will be able to survive this now. Do you forget my dodgy camera work? Oh! Nice! Excellent, I won. Oh, well, my ships is destroyed, so I'm going to be now at a major disadvantage in every fight that I get into. We did get some loot out of it, though. And I saw some evil pirates, so... Yay.